Good evening and welcome to another how-to video. Today what we're going to be doing is looking at how to embed a shockwave file in a Moodle book. It's pretty easy. The first thing of course that you need to do is create your shockwave file but we're not going to cover that today. So here we have Moodle, it's open. I'm going to log in and go to the area that I'm going to create the book. Make sure that turn editing on is on and I'm going to make a new book for this so we'll just call this uh, click save and display the first thing we're going to do is because we're going to embed the shockwave file and there's no actual tool in Moodle to do this we're going to go into the HTML code so we're going to go to the little toggle HTML source button here click that and you'll, you'll see these little elbows appear and we're going to paste this code in I'm going to put this code in the notes with this video so you can copy paste it directly into your Moodle site and also make it available elsewhere I'll also put a, a link to the source where I got this code and would like to say thank you very much to the person who put this resource together and you also can go and have a look at this directly if you would like like I say I'll put a hyperlink to this person's site in my site here we have the code and what you will see is it says paste link here paste link here paste link here so what we have to do then is go and find the file so go back to the course that you um, are working in and you can open a link in a new tab or a new window Moodle's pretty cool it actually allows you to work in several windows at the same time without deleting what you're trying to save in another window then you go to files I've created a new folder called shockwave file click on that and you'll see here this is a shockwave file that I've uploaded earlier I just did that by clicking upload file, browse, found it and then uploaded it but like I say I've already done that just to save a little bit of time here into the folder I'm just going to click on that when you click on that you'll see this opens up so that was the shockwave file and what I did there was I highlighted the URL right clicked copied and then we're going to go back to this window and where it says paste here we're going to highlight that right click paste right click paste and you'll see that it comes up with the whole URL here right click paste with this one make sure that you don't paste over the the marks here because otherwise it won't work then you click save changes and there you go it's as easy as that that is how you embed your shockwave file in Moodle please let me know if you've got any questions and thank you very much